catering to the International Delight Cafe in the small town of Belmore. Since 1983, Long Islanders have stepped up to this diner's dessert counter to sample over 80 unique flavors of some of the best-tasting gelato in the country. And I've come here to try their crown jewel, a massive sundae known simply as The World. A two-and-a-half-gallon, ten-pound-plus frozen phenomenon. This ginormous sundae is packed with up to 30 scoops, loaded with toppings, and capped off with three Belgian waffles. And I can't wait to get the whole world in my hands. How long do you think it would take you to eat the world? Probably three hours. Three hours. I love you so specific. You know, three hours, 258, somewhere in there, depending upon if I'm into the toppings. But what's your favorite thing in this massive bowl? I think it's got to be the waffles. The waffles? Yeah. Because when the ice cream melts down, the waffles soak up. It tastes so good and nice. Wow, you nice sold me. Flavors. You want to share waffle with me right now? Sure. All right, I'll Let's. take one, you take one. Let's take a bite. All right, cheers. Cheers. At the core of the world is gelato, Italy's version of ice cream. Though gelato has a lower butterfat content than its American counterpart, it has less air whipped in, making it richer and creamier. Behind the counter, veteran gelato maker Tony Rolandi helps me whip up a batch of the first flavor in my world, fiume, the Italian word for river. What's in the river here? Well, right in here is a mixture of a vanilla and a chocolate okay. with an amaretto base. And then we're going to add cake, toasted coconut, almond, and then we're going to put a little bit of liquid chocolate that'll harden really nice on top of everything. Mmm. The quality of the gelato is just so incredible. It's rich without being too heavy. It's creamy without being too much so. And the crunch and the cake, just perfect. Mmm. With the fiume ready, Tony brings out one of the biggest bowls I've ever seen. This is a bird bath. This is not something you serve food in. That's the bowl. She scoops in the rest of my chosen flavors from the banana caramel and fudge covered monkey dew Ooh, ah! to the chocolate covered graham cracker and marshmallow samore. Like a moon pie crossed with a frozen campfire, building a melty mass of deliciousness. Oh, come on. That's it's a crazy. scoop. It looks like a scoop. It looks like a shark fin. It's a scoop. Okay, it's a scoop. The world keeps growing with hot fudge, caramel, and marshmallow. Oh, oh, oh. just looking at that makes me feel like a Ghostbuster. M&Ms and chocolate sprinkles. Then it's time for waffles. I, I can't believe waffles is actually a step in this. Well, All right, well, let's add some waffles. Okay. Tony brings the waffles to a crispy golden brown and loads them onto the world. Then she finishes things off with five dollops of whipped cream. All right, let's go eat the world. Will you join me? Sure. On our global expedition? Let's do this. Mm, I have no idea what flavor I'm eating, and I'm completely okay with that. Cold, delicious, like it doesn't get too sweet. So good. Couldn't agree more. It's like um, biting into a giant, awesome ice cream cone. And the fact that it's malted and light is so good. Mm.